Hi guys, how are y'all? Hope y'all are doing well. So today is October 2nd and it's Gandhi Jayanti, so the birth of um, Gandhi Ji. And uh, so yeah, so I had to do a video today because that man was pretty cool. I mean, he was he was secular minded, but he had his own convictions, but he wasn't about imposing it on others, you know? So that's what I think it should be. Do your own thing and let others do their thing. So anyway, what am I doing today? I am unboxing uh, a sari. Do I remember the last time we went to India, we bought, I bought this lovely sari for my mother. Uh, she looks so stunning in it. And then this one also is for her and it is by this brand called Masaba. Now I'm really intrigued by this brand because the mother and daughter duo are, uh, oh my God, they are so cool and they are so brave because a little bit of history, both of them survived in a country which I think would have been at that time very hostile to their situation. So having grown up in India, I know things can be easy for a mom, for a single mom, who probably had this child um, out of uh, wedlock, as they say, um, and uh, you know she wasn't married, and he was a she was a movie star. Um, I don't think she was you know one of the top movie stars, but you know we all knew who she was and respected her work. Boyfriend was at the time uh, this very famous um, West Indies cricket player. So they were sort of like a celebrity couple at that time. So that part was there, but they never got married. So now in the Indian context at that time, uh, it was a no, 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 no. It's, it still is in my family, but that's a different story. But so uh, she had this child who is, you know, not too many Blindians at that time. Now, of course, you have Kamala Harris and, you know, maybe in the United States, but even here and in the Western world, I haven't seen too many. So um, there is racism everywhere, not just uh, in the Western world. The degrees may be worse in some parts, but it exists, let's face it. So anyhow, I digress. Uh, but I guess it still gets to the point of this lovely sorry. Life couldn't have been easy for them. Single mom uh, with a with a daughter growing up uh, in India and who was of uh, African descent, you know, so um, or Caribbean descent. Then suddenly now they're back. The mother's back. The daughter's back. And the mother's got some, you know, she's working in some great movies. And the daughter is a designer. So I didn't know much about her, but now there is a Netflix series also on her, uh, based on her life. And it's, it was cool, you know, at, at first I was like, this happens in India. I mean, I was having a little bit of a cultural um, confusion. This, this, this dissonance I was experiencing, I was like, I need to be open to this. And I loved that show, it was fantastic. And she's a natural actor as well. She's really good. So this is, I'm talking about the daughter now. So, and she's a designer. And I was like, okay, maybe, you know, she designs stuff, big deal. But I started seeing more and more about her stuff and her website is great. And then finally I ordered a sari and um, and also a lipstick. I threw that in for myself. The sari is going to my mother. Uh, it's a surprise gift for her for Christmas. She doesn't watch my videos. Actually, she doesn't know about it because I'm not sure how long I'll do this and I don't want to get, you know, make a big deal out of this and then they'll keep asking what happened to that and, you know, this is too much stress. So I will let them know if I find that I'm doing this for more than a year and at least I should have 50 videos, right? But this is going to be a surprise for her and uh, I was getting all excited because this is the holiday season. Everybody is buying stuff. Um, you know, I mean, this Diwali is coming up and Durga Puja for the Bengalis happened. I know Rosh Hashanah for the Jews, not that, uh, you know, uh, my Jewish friends are wearing saris, but we're starting to get in the mood to celebrate, right? So I was like, I can still buy something. So I bought a sari and the sari is made by Masaba designer and I have to tell you it was very professional. I ordered it, it got here and they kept updating me extremely good and go to their website you'll find um, saris you know anything you want to wear for an Indian occasion. I know people are buying even for their weddings now uh, but I just love the professionalism. Now let's see what it's like. I'm nervous. I'm always nervous whenever I do something new. Let's see what this is going to be like. So I have you know I have a nice Oxo scissors to open this, but I always need my Kerala knife. Such a versatile knife, you know, for every damn thing. 
This is what you use, oh my god. Okay guys, oh my god, the moment of truth. I love the, 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 the red bindi style, you know, the dot on there. It's such a lovely contrast with the black and the gold. Okay, here we go. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. How lovely. It says Masaba. Thank you. And we have the holy cow. Or is that the bull? Is that a bull? I can't tell the difference. You're the most valued part of Masaba's tribe. Ooh. Thank you for your purchase. We hope you like it as much as we loved crafting it with great attention to detail. There is attention to detail, I can tell. Okay. Oh, do tag us in your unboxing video or pictures. Okay, I'll tag them. No problem. <laughs> okay, so that's that. I can see, oh, this is the lipstick I ordered. I had to have something for myself. You know, self-appreciation gift for being such a thoughtful daughter, of course. Um, so, Masaba by Nika. Uh, matte lipstick. This, this, I can't wait. I mean, I, I love red. So I think I tried to get something as red as possible. I think, I can't even remember, it was a while ago. Oh, it's not even red, sort of. Let's see the color. Oh, it's a nice red. It's not bad. I don't want to put it on right now and then I'll look like a clown for the rest of the video. What if it doesn't work? But I'll do that later. Okay, now for the sari. Oh my God, I love this bag, this dust bag that it comes in. Again, the same. It has the same bulls on it in gold against a lovely cream colored khadi cotton uh, material, like linen. Khadi is linen, I think. Oh, that's so nice. And it has the smell of India, guys. It has the smell. Look at this detail on the dust bag. There's a little button made of pearls. That is so nice. So cute. And so unlike anything I've seen before. This is this is art, this is creativity. Um, amazing, amazing. And then we have it here. Ta-da! That's the blouse piece and it's unstitched. Pink color, yes. I don't know if it's a color is too much for my mom. My daughter thought so, but I'm like, my mother is, is glamorous. So, uh, I think she can pull it off. And also there is, uh, you know, this will be her blouse piece. Also, maybe I, I can take it. I don't know. Not that I wear saris. Um, and this is the sari. Oh, the material is is interesting. Is it cotton? I don't even know. I'll put it in the link in the description. I can't remember what it was. Uh, one of a kind, dry clean only. Free size. Ah, it's it's a light material, so that's got to be good. She wants to wear it. Oh my gosh. You know, this is a color that she can wear in Kerala. You know, the traditional Kerala saris are white and uh, cream, mish and gold. So this is like traditional color. So, so it will go really well in the hot weathers and for solemn occasions, like if she goes to the church or she goes to a baptism or um, just on a hot sunny day, right? So she can wear this. Wow, I think it's nice. And it's got a little color on the back with this tassel. Is there just one tassel? What's up with that? Well, she'll figure it out. It seems nice. It seems nice to me. And then you wear this blouse along here. And it's a beautiful contrast. Right? Ta-da! And then maybe she'll hand it down to me. You know, this happens to me a lot. I get things for others 
and then I want to keep it. Oh God, no, I can't do this. I can't do this. This is for her. Maybe I'll get another one for myself and just look at it and just do, do this and sit around here. I want it, but I'll give it, I'll give it to her. For example, I want to give you an example. We're digressing here, but you know, what's, what's life without a little bit of distraction, right? So I got this, let's go over, see this plant here. And then I got this little turtle when I went to India last and I thought I'll give it to my friend just as a little souvenir, you know, it's made out of wood and it's really cute. And then I never gave it. I just kept it here. I just loved it so much. I gave her some really nice spices, a box of spices that I bought from Lulu Mall, a lovely store there. And then I wanted to keep that as well, but I regretted giving the spices too. What's wrong with me? Does that happen to you guys? Oh God, they're going to be watching this video and you'll be like, hmm, you didn't want to give it to us, huh? But no, no, I mean, I just, I just wished I had bought one for myself also. Let's put it that way. Everything I give others, maybe that goes to say that I buy my friends and family good stuff, right? That's what it says. Things that I would want also, right? So the intentions are pure. So let's get back to our sari. So here it is. It's got tassels on two ends. Here too. Very nice. I'm really liking it. Let's go outside because I remember the sari shops, of course, they, they light it up really well, you know, so I've done that too over here and uh, lit up the place. Oh, my lights conked off on one side. But um, so, so yeah, they light it up well. But my mother, some of the ladies are so smart. They'll be like, we need to take this outside and see what it's like, you know? So, so let's go do that. Not a very sunny day right now, but uh, oh my gosh, it's really nice. It's lovely. Let's get the blouse piece, blouse piece as well. How is it guys? It's nice, no? It's so nice. Now I want to go attend a wedding or something. I would wear this. And you go attend a wedding and sari makes every woman look so hot, especially Indian women. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's our curvaceous bodies or our dark hair and just our grace and elegance. It's meant for the world, right? It's uh, people of any uh, background can wear it and have a good, time actually feel one feels really sexy in a sari i have to say i love it i love it namaste ji namaste kaise hain aap you know in the if you're in north india you could say that um in kerala you're like are you manslayo etra naala hi kandittu you know so lovely Hmm. I could put out my judgy. No, with this sari, it's not going to work. My judgmental nature um, works so well in Kerala. You're like, hmm. You're assessing them, you know, you're being totally judgmental. So guys, that was the unboxing of my lovely Masaba sari. And I have to say, I am not at all disappointed. I am thrilled to this and it was as I expected, maybe even better because I love the detail of the dust bag and the packaging. It just made me happy. And this is about $160, $70. Oh, I have to show you my lipstick, right? Let's put that on. So guys, I put a little bit of the lipstick. I think I have it in more places than my lips. But anyway, um, and it's got a little brownish tinge to it and a little hint of brown orange copper looks very good on Indian women I know that uh, it's called make it happen how inspiring make it happen is the color and uh, it's light I don't think I put it on right but um, that's the color it doesn't probably clashes with the pink so let's take that off and um, yeah for a nice subtle uh, classy look um, the lipstick is good too. So guys, I stepped outside after wearing that lipstick and it's not bad, right? It's nice. It's a good color. I like it. 
So I'm sitting here in the United States and I ordered it and I know of one other person who's done it and very professional, it got here and no complaints. So, so don't be afraid to, to get it. And guys, you can trust me on this because you know, I'm not getting paid for this, uh, uh, for endorsing the brand. I have like two followers. <laughs> So it'll probably cost you a fortune to get this sewed here. I don't even want to think about it. You know, it's going to be pretty bad. Um, so that is the problem because in India, it's a piece of cake. Like every person has their favorite tailor. Like my mother has, you have to go, you know, through the side streets and the gullies and then get into, uh, you know, some uh, an obscure part of town to get to this, it is really talented uh, blouse maker. Um, so that's not going to happen here. Yeah, but I have heard that uh, you can get blouses uh, made of lycra, you know, uh, from Amazon and Etsy. So something that's more stretchy. So you could get the color and try it. But I don't know if if it works out well or not. Um, but uh, but that's that's an option. And uh, as far as a petticoat is concerned, I've heard you can wear leggings. So guys, that's it from me and uh, have a nice day, have fun, buy yourself a little something, you know, something good, something high quality, something expensive. Uh, although I didn't buy this for myself, but I want to, I can see how it can make one so happy. Um, so I guess buying for others also makes you happy. Um, except I have a couple, I have, I, I wanted to now. So guys, bye and uh, Thank you for watching and I hope you'll get yourself one. This is a treat. You know, sometimes you get stuff and you're like, mm, it's okay, you forget about it. But this made me really happy. So check it out and uh, check out their website and see if you like it. And I'll catch you in the next video. Bye-bye.